dog fires. Any more patience, Hallie? No, Doc. You just have to finish filling in your charts. A doctor's work is never done. Neither is a hippo's. I'm gonna tidy up back here. We're so busy taking care of toys, sometimes we forget doctors and nurses can get hurt too. Take the case of the hippo's rip. It all started like any other day. We were busy fixing toys, like we always do. Kent, you're ready to roll. <laughs> Oh my! <gasps> Hallie, you've got a rip. Oh, I just pulled a stitch. No time to fix it now. We had a lot of patience that day. Ben's huggy hand got twisted. Niles had a kink in his crane. And Tilly just needed a good hug to remind him everything was okay. <laughs> <gasps> oh, Hallie, your stuffing's coming out. You have to tell Doc. Lammy, I'm here to help patients, not be a patient. Hallie, everyone needs help, even nurses. Everyone gets hurt sometimes. It's okay to tell. You don't have to hide. Person or dragon, tiny or tall. Sometimes we tumble <laughs> and sometimes we fall. Everyone gets hurt sometimes. Oh, I guess you're right. Doc, I have something to show you. And that's when my favorite nurse became my favorite patient. Are you sure it's gonna stay? I've been known to strut my stuff, if you know what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> I do. So let's put you through some tests to make sure your stuffing is going to stay inside. How about giving me a shimmy? Oh, feels good, Doc. Looks good, too. <laughs> One last test. How about your hippo hop? Woo, girl, I'll show you. But don't make me do it alone. Go, Go Hallie. Hallie. Go, Go Hallie. Hallie. Woo! You've got one happy hippo on your hands, Doc. Woo! Another satisfied patient at Doc McStuffin's Clinic for Stuffed Animals and Toys. Great work today, Doc. Thanks, Hallie. Tomorrow is another day. And we'll see another toy. <laughs> exactly.